Omega. You spoke way too soon. I did? Oops. Yes, you did. Yeah. I was like asking for one? silence. So here's a um, additional little trivia here. If you actually look at the opening title screen, you see how shiny both the uh, the characters' heads are. Look at tails and get the idea of something else that's shiny. For some yeah. reason, the games are always loud. Oop. Any hint at all? Oh, I get it. I Wait, see. sorry. I was I was like responding to somebody. What? Goddamn demos, they play a horn. No, I was saying, if you actually look at the title screen, you see how shiny their heads are. This kind of gives yeah. you a hint of something about my own little history when um, I first played the game. Uh-huh. Because I'm shiny, like the treasure in a sunken pirate wreck. <laughs> um... Uh, I'm trying to figure it out. What is Tails? Nice. He's a two-tailed fox. Oh, so that's the inspiration for your character. So you like to rub oil on your fox so it shines? Oh my fucking- Get out! Get out! You sick fuck! Get out! Get out! You motherfucker! You guys are so fucking stupid! This title screen was how I got my fucking username! Hey, Golden, Golden. No! I'm just, fuck I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> yeah, you're a piece you're of shit for that. Job. You're doing a terrible job. Oh. Regardless, this is Sonic 2. Uh, this is a lot of people's favorite entry in the J Genesis series. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and get this shit started because I, I, I gotta get that shit out of my head. You see, you see, you just got Sonic to just go like, fuck this ranks. I just want to kill myself because of what Riley said. <laughs> you are so... Murder! Uh, yeah, murder indeed. More like fucking suicide enabling. Go for me, toaster bath. God damn it. Oh, kiss my ass. I'm already getting my ass kicked here. What the fuck hit me? What the fuck? You're like 30 seconds ahead of us, man. <laughs> I know, but still, like... Yeah, this one you can do the spin dash! A very useful tool that apparently the first game did not have. Yeah. It, it kind of doesn't feel like Sonic without the spin dash, not gonna lie. Yeah. The, the way I see the first game is that there was a lot of trial and error involved, and... I mean, yeah, it's the first game in the series, so there... There's bound to be, like, errors involved and shit like that. Oh, yeah. I could still... I still have a right to just, like, a bragging right where I just, like, I beat the game fair and square. Like, I had to play it multiple times to be so patient to go through the game, especially the Labyrinth Zone. Oh, yeah. Labyrinth Zone was just a pain in my rear. It's a you pain in... Just a... The old... hmm? What are you gonna say, Bradley? Have you ever just watched the background of the game and just get kind of hypnotized by how beautiful the sprite work is and just the background? Yeah, actually, um, the funny thing is, uh, when I was a kid, like, Sonic was how I was introduced to the term video games. Like, I obviously grew up with Nintendo, starting with the Super NES, but I first heard about the Sega Genesis and then I saw the gameplay of it, and something about it was eye-catching. I didn't really get into Sonic until Adventure, though. Yeah. Cause it's, it's weird, like... Jesse, you may want to do something with your dog. Yay, I gotta continue! Yay. Oh, that's the other thing about Sonic 2, it's a lot more forgiving. Like, aside from the ability to spin dash, uh, you're able to collect uh, rings much easier, the level design's better, and not to mention, under a small, like, a easier uh, t um, a time restraint, you can gather as many continues. Stop the <laughs> you know the funny thing is, my favorite Sonic game is still probably Adventure. Adventure? Oh, on the uh, Dreamcast, I think it is? Well, I got the GameCube version, so... Oh, okay. DX. I still have yet to check out uh, the Adventure games, but I will say this, uh, as far as the Genesis games go, Sonic 3 and Knuckles is easily my favorite. I mean, oh, yeah. Adventure 1 
the voice acting is god awful. Like, oh my I god. I can't expect has, that. Like, the lip flaps do not match at all. No, and they I, you do can, not! I mean, it's, it's, no, it's no fault on the voice actors themselves. You can just tell they were given terrible direction. But, how uh, was it? I like how there's this big hub world that lets you go to each of the different worlds and you play as multiple characters. Like, that was, like, kind of my problem with Sonic 2. Adventure 2, I mean. Uh -huh. Is that they didn't really have that big hub world to really just roam around, explore, and stuff. You kind of just went from one level to the next. Wait, wait, wait. Damn it! Get in there! Please Damn it! Alright. There must be another way in there. I see a barrier. Barrier, you say? Yeah, they have the, the, the barriers. Cool, I got another Stop extra life. a barrier around your heart, Golden. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? You put a barrier around your heart. Let us love you. <laughs> uh, by the way, somebody asked me about the Sonic movie. Yes, I saw it, and I actually have um, a recorded review of it. It's going to be up, hopefully, very soon. God. You were saying, Gold? I said, yes, I saw the Sonic movie, and I loved it. Um, yes, I have a review of it on the way. I've already recorded a script for it. I just got to do a little bit of editing, and then... Oh, damn it! It'll be on the way. Get used to me grunting every time my character takes a hit. I was especially a lot more like that when it came to the first Sonic game, because, dear God. You needed to get as many lives and continues as possible due to how ridiculously hard the first one was. You got hit. You're like, God, fucking damn it. Oh, hi. Casino zone to be is fair, a lot zone. of, like, old games from the 80s were ridiculously hard, so... Birch, to respond to what you said about Casino Zone, it's actually my least favorite stage. Because it's too claustrophobic. I mean, the only positive thing you could say is that it has a casino feature, or a gambling feature, but that's just a gambling problem itself. <laughs> I'm gonna try and see with Aeon next week if I can. You should, Riley. It's good. That's what I've heard. I like who voiced this version of Sonic, and it's not the actual game, not the game version. Oh, you mean um, <laughs> um, yeah. Schwartz. Yeah, the voice of every guy. blue character now. Voice of every let's, blue character? Is there a joke right there that's going over my head? Let's see, he's uh, Dewey, I believe, in DuckTales, the blue one. Fuck! Right. He's yes, yes, Leonardo right. in the new Ch Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, which oh, yeah. is the blue one, and now he's fucking Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> I didn't notice the pattern until now, that's funny. You know what? I'll give you that. And also, I have to give credit for um, Jim Carrey. He did a great job playing it. Oh, he, he 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 had too much fun. Like he's. And you can tell he did. It was so funny. Give me a big fat we're gonna try our best not to spoil anything about the movie because I know there's people who haven't seen it yet. Um, I'm gonna keep this in clip notes. I did see the end, uh, the, the somewhat post-credit moment. What the hell happened there? Whoa, what the fuck? What? The game just started to, like, jitter. What the hell happened? It might be all the objects on screen while you're streaming or something. Because there's a lot of stuff going on in the background there. Oh yeah, I just wa I just saw it on. Screen. Oh, are you talking about like the background in the game? Yeah. Cause there's a lot of stuff for the game to have to render at once and for an old system like that. I wouldn't be surprised. So much for a blast processor. Ha! <laughs> but no, <laughs> um, I will say that uh, there was. I'm not gonna give spoilers, but there is something during the post credit scene, or during the credit scene. Um, I was very happy. Me Yeah. No spo. Yeah, no, no spoilers, but yeah, no we were. Spoiler. No, not gonna spoil. No, no spoilers. <laughs> no spoilers. <laughs> um, I also saw like there was like somebody recorded it in the theater, and people were cheering like, "Yeah!" Oh, that's 
Yeah, I thought it was... Hmm. I gotta be careful, like, not to get specific, but... Anybody who has seen the movie, you'll know what I'm talking about. Yep, yep. I got to watch it with my daughter. We had fun. <laughs> I still like that moment. It's like, uh... Meow? <gasps> it's so stupid, and yet it's just so satisfying. I'm gonna post that clip. Where are you? There we go, it's in the meme-tastic thing. Could you imagine how much lag it's gonna be for Casino Night Zone? Dear lord. Oh no! Oh! I jumped way too over, like, overboard on that. Oh, come on, Zappy. Sorry, I'm talking to my game. Come on, Zippy! Don't get- don't die on me! Don't die on me, girl! Heal, heal! Oh no! Oh. I think that's the other thing about um. Oh fuck! Um, the the Eggman uh, fights during each stage they were actually much more challenging, whereas in the first one, yeah, there was a bit of a trial and error right there, but it was so like they they became such a cakewalk. But I'm still always challenged with this one. What? What? You were not listening to any of this at all, were you? No, sorry, I was watching that clip that I <laughs> that somebody posted on Twitch. <laughs> what I clip? Posted in the, the, I posted in the meme tastic counter. <laughs> oh. I'm afraid to ask. It was from when, a little while ago in the ch in the stream. <laughs> Oh, for the for Derek who's asking what Pokemon game I'm playing, I'm playing uh, a Sapphire. Because I forgot to get all I forgot to complete this Aquatic game. Aquatic Ruin Zone. This game, this stage is a little punishing if you're not careful. <laughs> like that. Those freaking Eggman arrows. No joke. God damn it! Damn. Got hit by one of those Stop drill that. penguin things. So yeah, isn't that like the, that. Wasn't that a character in the Sonic Adventures TV show? <laughs> yeah, he was. There was like a blue one, then there was like the red rooster thing from that Sonic Adventures TV. Oh, show. you're talking about the two, um, those two robot idiots? Yeah, who were like uh, Doctor Robot. Yeah, it's from the TV show. I know what you're yeah, talking about. Yeah, if we're gonna Sonic go for like any like Sonic show. That was the shit. It is easily Sonic Sat AM. Like, that I, show I knew what it was doing. The yep. only Sonic show I was able to watch before Sonic X was uh, The Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog on, like, Toon Disney. I never said anything yeah. about Sonic X. And I'm just I telling know. you, the only Sonic series I... The first Sonic series I was able to watch before Sonic X, the only one I was able to watch was The Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. I had never seen Sat AM. Yeah. Uh, okay, fair enough. Now, there's, I did, however... Ooh, there's sorry. one reason why I didn't watch Sonic X that much. Chris. Everybody hated Chris. Yeah, Chris because... is such a yeah. self-insert. And was such a whiner on top of that. I'm like, oh my He's god. so lonely, but he has a millionaire father who owns a big business and an actress mother. Yeah, he I saw like, I saw fucking one... fucking Doc Brown for a grandpa. Yeah, a, no, a I've, ninja I've seen one episode where Tails is talking to like a professor. And they're talking about uh, how they're going to try to get back to their own world. And Chris overhears it and he makes a big fuss about it. I'm like, dude, shut the fuck up. I agree. And then there was the fact that he had actual friends at his school, so that's another thing. I'm like, this kid 